no matter what your age, a good magic trick <laughs> can always surprise you. Good day, Columbus's Johnny DiLoretto is live at Easton with a professional magician. Johnny. <laughs> with many professional magicians, Tom. <laughs> check this out, I've already picked up a few pointers. Watch, I'm gonna bend this spoon. He but looks like a magician. John, it takes a little <laughs> concentration. If I add a little of Look at that, I bent it. How about that? That is pretty impressive. Right. Not bad. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. John Petz and his team of world-class magicians. They're all here, ready to roll, man. Yeah. Tell me about Miracles of Magic happening this weekend. Hey, Miracles of Magic is at the Capitol Theater, 1 o'clock and, and 5 p.m., sorry. Okay. And it is world-class magicians from around the world all to benefit a kid again. And we'll tell you more about a kid again, but go ahead and show me how you bend a spoon. Well, yeah, well, I mean, anyone can take a metal spoon and bend it, but I thought we'd take it a step further, and I drew one up just to save time, kind of like the cooking shows are. Okay. Let's see if I can get it for you just like oh, that. That's how about that? Isn't that, that all right? That is more impressive, yeah, and you didn't even have to go, mm. No! Like that, no. All right, Sound Michael effects Kent. not included. Michael yeah. Kent's with us as well. We got Steve Branham down here. You got your cell phone? Yeah, here's my cell phone. <laughs> I'll put the cell phone down for a minute and blow up a balloon. <laughs> this is the trick, just right here. Just okay. blow up a balloon. That's amazing. Thank you. It's amazing. Astounding. Okay, now watch this. <laughs> cell phone is in there. And I'm. New cell phone case for you. There you go. Cell Thanks. phone case. I hope that doesn't inflate my bill. Uh, <laughs> uh, I got, it's yours. You can keep it. Nice. You take it. All right. And what, what do we got? We got 15 seconds here. Okay, this is the very first trick I ever learned. I had a black knife when I was a kid. No, no. No, I had a uh, white knife. I used a white knife. Okay. No, We're no. going to have to go. I'll tell you what. We'll be right back after these messages. More magic. No, it was a black knife. All right, it's Miracles and Magic this morning with our own Johnny DiLoretto. He is live at Easton making magic. And Johnny, you're doing a really good job. Thank you, Amy. Thanks, Tom. <laughs> We're at Martini Park where the preview party for Miracles and Magic is tomorrow night. Yes. Then the big show is Saturday at the Rife Center. Am I right? Yes, sir. This is Aaron DeLong. Aaron, you're going to share with us a, uh, another trick. This is just a magic extravaganza. Yes, absolutely. Uh, I'm not a stage guy. I'm okay. a close-up guy, which means I do magic with cards and coins and small objects. All right. Um, one of my favorite tricks is a trick called Metamorphosis. This is a trick where the magician ties up his assistant, puts her in a case, and then stands on top, throws up a shroud. When it comes down, they've swapped places. It's okay. very mystical. It's we're wonderful. Gonna, I'm not getting tied up. No, 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 no. Okay. Not, I mean, you know, no, not at all. <laughs> not uh, here, we're, right. we're actually going to recreate the effect okay. with uh, a card and some coins, if that's okay. That's fabulous. Let's go. Let's all right. do it. Um, so we've got a Chinese coin and a 50 cent piece here. Hold your hand out like a tent for me here, Johnny. Okay. Thank you very much. You're and welcome. we'll put a coin underneath there. Put your hand down. Okay. And then we'll just put the 50 cent piece on your hand. Now you can feel the Chinese coin underneath your hand, right? For the viewers yes. at home. The coin yeah, is there, I can yeah? Feel it, yeah, yeah. All right, perfect. Now we'll just use the card. This is gonna be like the yeah, shroud. 30 the seconds. Throws it up. Okay. okay, all right, here we go. Watch careful. We say the magic word, Barbasol. Watch carefully, here we go. And the coin changes. Take That's a look awesome. at what's underneath your hand. Oh, it's the Half dollar. The half dollar, absolutely. That is sweet. Thank you very much. Pretty cool. And Barbasol, by the way, is the sponsor of the show. That's right. Barbasol. Why didn't I get the ding? <laughs> oh, try it again, try it again. <clears throat> Barbasol. There we go. <laughs> there you go. How about that? Pretty sweet. Come on back. Eventually, someone's getting cut in half. Okay. <laughs> All right, great. As long as it's not you, we're okay. All right. All right. All right, the mysterious Johnny DiLoretto. More coming up with him in just a little bit. Stay with us. <laughs> it looks interesting, too, because it looks like they're really trying to contemporize the ma magic. Johnny's <laughs> there right now. Johnny, it, it seems like uh, this is really kind of an event. Magic, I'm going to say it, can be a little bit cheesy, but these guys look like they're kind of hip young magicians, yes? These guys are awesome, Tom. Uh, John Petz puts this wonderful show on every year for a kid again. It's a fabulous show. We've been doing some close-up tricks, oh, yeah. but John, the show is big, right? It is. On Saturday, it's the big stuff. In fact, we've got Matt King coming in from Las Vegas, Christopher Hart from Hollywood, Joshua J. New York City. And you can expect to see some of the bigger things, the illusions, like yep. Maggie's tucked in here right now. Right. we got Maggie in this uh, thing. What, Should we, we check it out? Yeah. We're Let's see if we can't do this. We are going to cut her in half. Check it out. Watch close. <laughs> Just like that smile for Maggie. There you there go. She is. Pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Now, she's cut in half, though. We got her all the way around. Yeah. Oh my God. That is that is amazing. Is that amazing or what? Yeah. Get our audience here. I'm just gonna leave Maggie hanging like that. I mean, that's oh, Michael. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to uh, disturb your uh, Oreo eating. <laughs> so look at that. 
Oreos, you can't just eat one, literally. But anyway, you'd be just doing that forever, John. Tell me real quick, the show is Saturday. Saturday, 1 in 5. Tickets at Ticketmaster or call a Kappa box office or get on miraclesandmagic.com. All proceeds benefit a kid again. I'll tell you what, I have seen the show, and you don't want to miss it. It's spectacular. Come on back. We'll wrap up with some magic and families from a kid again. I love it. Johnny, that looks like so much fun. I can't wait to see it. All right, so family fun this weekend, and it's all for a very good cause. The mysterious Good Day Columbus's Johnny DiLoretto is live at Easton with a look at the Miracles and Magic Show. Johnny, what's going on? Uh, hey, Tom, first, can you guys hear me? Yes. yes. Okay, I just, Ambrosia wanted to make sure I had my microphone on this time. <laughs> I do. I got it on. All right, A Kid Again is an organization that provides group activities, fun group activities for kids with life-threatening illnesses. It's an amazing organization. And uh, Avalon, you're going to be part of the big show Saturday, right? Yes. How awesome is that? Very awesome. And you're looking forward to it, right? Yep. What are you going to do? I'm going to make the big finale. You're going to be a part of the big finale? Yes. Which I hear is something pretty special, right? Uh-huh. And you're going to look fabulous? Yes. Like you do this morning? That's great. And Alicia, mom, otherwise known as mom, mom, tell me about what this organization means to you. A Kid Again is amazing. When you have a medical child and you're stressed and you're sitting in the hospital and money is tight, thank you, medical child, mm -hmm. A Kid Again gives you something to look forward to. Yeah. We get to go to King's Island. We have all sorts of fun getaways. And it, it's something to look forward to. It really gives them their child childhood back right. and it gives the sibs their childhood back too. That's great. Well, thank you for being here this morning. Let's talk about Miracles and Magic. Sure. John Petz uh, starts tomorrow. It does. Actually, at Martini Park, that's the adult night out. If you love the close-up sleight of hand, it's an all-you-can-drink, all-you-can-eat type party. Details at miraclesandmagic.com. Here at 6.30 to 10 tomorrow night. And then on Saturday is the big show, completely family-friendly. Lots of tickets still available for some decent seats, but you can check out, again, uh, Ticketmaster.com, Ticketmaster or Miracles and Magic. Yeah, and let's thank you really quickly. We have 15 seconds left. All our magicians this morning uh, have been fabulous. They have been absolutely fabulous. You can see them here tomorrow night, but Michael Kent, Aaron along Michael Dustman, Steve Brandon, we appreciate them being out here. All right. I appreciate you, sir. Thank you, Johnny. Thank very you much. Very much. Back to you guys and good day. All right, thanks, Johnny. Go make some of those beverages disappear. <laughs> Still to come, a local magician uses his talents to help a great cause. Thanks for watching ABC6 News and making us the fastest growing local news in Central Ohio. One area organization works magic for kids with life-threatening illnesses, and every year one local magician puts a team of world-class illusionists together to put smiles on little faces. Johnny DiLoretto has a sample of the talent from the annual Miracles and Magic show. Miracles and Magic, a big, spectacular magic show, benefits a kid again, a great organization, and Michael Kent, one of the performers there. Michael, I understand you want some money. Could I, could I borrow a dollar? You could. Sure. That was it. That's the trick. That's no, it. I, watch. Now my hands won't go near my sleeves or my pockets or anything like this. Watch closely, we're just gonna fold that dollar up. And when we unfold it, something very strange has happened. Now Steve Branham's got a trick up his sleeve here, Steve, go ahead. Okay, we got a uh, blue deck of cards here, and I got a red card I'm gonna s insert into the center of the pack. So you wanna mm -hmm. take one out, or just, got it? Did you get one? Okay, which card? Did you, did you see? Which one? I picked the Eight of Diamonds. The Eight of Diamonds. Flip it over. That's my red card. It's the red card. Yes. It's amazing. Michael Dustman, what are we doing? Well, Johnny, everybody thinks that magicians use sleight of hand, that we're doing something sneaky with our hands. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you all the coins, let you do the magic in I'm your gonna, hands. I'm going to do it. Here, you count out loud. Okay, one, two, oops, three, four, five. How many in your hand? Yeah, five. How many of mine? None. Very good. I'm just going to put them in a little stack just like that. Okay. Johnny, just by the edge, I want you to grab that top coin. Okay. Place it in my hand. Close your hand as fast as you can. Watch what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that last coin. I'm going to heat it up just like this. Watch. Did you feel anything? No, not a thing. Go ahead. Open up your hand. How many you got? Five. And none of it would be possible without John Petz. Well, thank you. John, it's an amazing show. Tell me what's going on tomorrow and Saturday. Sure. Well, on tomorrow night is the opening night party here at Martini Park. It's at 6.30, and uh, tickets from $50 to $100, all benefiting the Kittigan organization. But just a great party full of close-up illusions and sleight of hand from the best of the best, literally in the world. Spectacular. Thank you very I, much, Thank sir. you, Johnny. I appreciate it. From Martini Park, I'm Johnny DiLoretto, ABC6, on your side.